Hey guys, how's it going? Toby here and welcome to a brand new series here on my channel called The Deck of Cards Road to Glory and I really hope you guys are going to enjoy this one. It's a series idea that I thought of last night whilst I was trying to get to sleep and I love the concept. It's a really interesting idea and I really, really hope you guys are going to enjoy this one. So if you like the sound of it, once I explain the rules in a second, please hit the like button and give me any suggestions to improve it. I'd really really help me out but before we do get started if you're looking for a place to get some coins check the link in the description for the fifa shop.co.uk a really awesome website and if you use the code toby10 you get a discount of every single one of your orders so this series is so so simple it's literally a road to glory where i'm starting from scratch but there is a little minor point that's going to make it a little bit difficult for us to make a good team so we're going to be going through seasons and tournaments and all that sort of stuff, a bit of training if needs be. But the way that we're going to get players, and this is the only way, is by picking a card from a 52 playing card deck. So, we've got 1 to 10, we've got the face cards, and all four suits. So, the way it works is, say we get a number card. That number is what we go to the auction house with, go to that page, and pick a player on that page. But that's not it. If we get a black card, a black suit, so spades and clubs... We get to pick the best player on that page, but if it's a red card, hearts or diamonds, we're going to have to pick the worst player on that page. So let me show an example. Now I want you guys to decide, if we get a face card like this, so Jack, Queen, King and Ace, what should we get? I think coin bonuses, with Jack being the lowest coin bonus and Ace being the highest, but we do decide to give you an example and this is if we get say a number card. So we've got a 10 and it is a 10 of diamonds, which means we're going to have to pick the worst player on the 10th page of the auction house. Now this is gonna be something I need from you guys as well. Should there be any search criteria? I personally think it'd be kind of exciting if there was no search criteria, like literally just searching every single player, hopefully, if FIFA decides to show us it, on the market, which is going to be pretty interesting. So we're gonna to go to the 10th page, we've got the 10 of diamonds, and we're gonna try and pick out the worst card and that is going to be the AC Milan player, 75 rated, non-rare gold, which is Poli. So, to be fair, not that bad and definitely would be in our price range if we get some coins. But this is just an example. I want to show you how the series would work. This isn't actually for the series yet. We're going to have to go into an online game, which we're going to head over and do now. And this is my first opponent. Thank you, EA Matchmaking, for showing me an opponent with Crespo. Fantastic. How am I ever going to win? If you missed my team, by the way, check back to the start of the video about a minute in and you'll see the team that I'm rolling with. If you didn't see it, he decides to do the old kickoff glitch and I even knew he was going to do it. If you saw the radar, I was trying to pull some players back, but I just couldn't do it fast enough. Crespo's ridiculous, man. That five-star weak foot is pretty much unfair against my bronze team. It's... uh going to be tough to win this one we're 3-0 down second half we're into it and we actually managed to pick up a little consolation goal a pretty crazy strike for a bronze player from outside of the box and could this be the start of a beautiful comeback and over the top through ball to one of our center balls that I've put in striker position he's pretty pulled back but he managed to get the ball in the back of the net a ridiculous little comeback this could be but he has Crespo still and I don't really know what it was. I just couldn't close him down. Crespo is so good, man, and he's just been matched up against me. But he makes a mistake. We capitalize on it, and we get another consolation goal, making it 4-3. And to be fair, I'm counting that as a mini victory. His team was crazy, like so, so good. We have 500 coins, which isn't too bad. So not the greatest of starts, but hopefully we won't get match made against that again. And we do pull an ace. So that's a pretty good card if you guys want the coin bonuses. But let me know down in the comment section below. I'd really appreciate that. I hope you love this idea of the series. I really like it and I hope you guys do too. So let me know. Give it a like and subscribe for some more from myself. But thank you so much for watching guys. Take care. Have an amazing day and goodbye.